723 this morning. Once estranged, now a mother-daughter duo shares their personal story of overcoming conflict in their relationship. They are joining us now to talk about their journey with their new book called The Mother-Daughter Relationship Makeover. Lindsay and Leslie, there you are. Thanks for joining us this morning. Good Thanks morning. Thanks so for having us. All right, so I want one of you to go into what happened that you guys decided to disconnect for a short time. So, Leslie, I'll start with you. You, you kind of give me the backstory. Well, Lindsay and I had a habit of uh, fighting. We had a culture of fighting in our family. And as we uh, developed our website, Reach Out Recovery, and began uh, doing recovery work for addiction recovery, we found that we were relationship experts, but we could not get along in our own relationship. Lindsay, do you want to say some more about that? <laughs> Just a long-standing habit of bad communication skills. So now, did you guys uh, disconnect from each other for a short period of time, or, or what happened? Yeah, we disconnected, and we actually stopped speaking for four years, wow. four full years. Oh, I can't even imagine that with my mom. Um, okay, so then how do you, who approaches whom as you try to connect once again? What, how, how was the connection made? Um, well, I wanted to. It was me who, and the point of the book is, when you do all the work that you're supposed to do on yourself to, to heal and find forgiveness, when it works, you're not angry anymore. So I wasn't angry, and I really wanted to reconnect with my mom. But I think it took her a few more minutes than me to be ready. <laughs> Why did it take you longer, Mom? Well, I was angry because Lindsay and I had produced two documentaries together and we had developed a website and she took off and left. And um, I, I just was so upset. It's like you lose your daughter and yeah. you don't know if she's ever gonna come back. And so when she did wanna make uh, amends to me and uh, return to our relationship, I wanted an apology for her from her. And I think that is the, the point of our book, that sometimes you, you have to decide whether you want the relationship or you, yeah. want to be, you want to be right, or do you want to be back together? So interesting, because so many mothers and daughters have sort of difficult relationships oftentimes. So out of all of this and what people can take away from the book, what would be the number one piece of advice that you would tell a mother and daughter? that you really have to take some time and understand what's happened in the relationship. You need to look at what your communication habits are. You have to look at what the triggers are between the two of you, what you're fighting about, and really find a way to find compassion. That's the key takeaway, finding compassion for your mother or your daughter and what she's been through so that you can have um, a little bit more warmth and um, good feeling about the relationship and the person. I think that's such good advice in every relationship, right? Yes. <laughs> All right. All right. Uh, are there times, though, that you think maybe it's better to just disconnect and maybe take that year or months or weeks to separate and not talk until people can sort of get their bearings again? Absolutely. Particularly if you're in a toxic relationship with your mother or your daughter and there is some uh, verbal abuse going on or there's nagging or you, you're just you have uh, cultural differences with um, you know, all kinds of uh, problems like that, taking a step back and spending less time together will give you the opportunity to take a look at yourself. What, what is your part in your, in your conflict? Mm -hmm. Who is triggering whom? And uh, sometimes, you know, what Lindsay taught me is that sometimes it's better to be friendly and to be together than it is to be right. So mothers often think that they're they're right in everything that they're doing, but they're not always right. Yeah. So um, backing off can be very helpful. All right. Either way, moms, we love you. All right, ladies, thank you so much. We appreciate you. For more information, you can check out their website, reachoutrecovery.com, or visit their social media site. Tom